Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Oh, I'm sorry if I sound really weird. I am sick right now, but that is hopefully fine. Um, and today I'm going to be doing a one color, not one color challenge. I'm going to be doing a, a I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a really cute outfit, in my opinion, in different colors, and then combining those colors at the end. So I'm going to be doing three colors, then combining those three colors into one outfit in royal high. And you can also copy these. I do not mind if you do. Go ahead and, and copy if you do, because that's what this is really for. So, before we do start this video, well, I just want to say I really hope you'll enjoy these outfits. And these are just, in my opinion... They don't have to be good in your opinion, just in mine right now, but if they're good in your opinion, then yay. So first off, we are going to do a color I do not particularly like, which is pink. I really dislike pink, but I like a cute outfit in my opinion in pink. So let's get this started. Why don't we? So... Since we're going to do this, is I guess we might as well get this started. So first, go to dress up and take off any accessories. And don't mind my link. Then you put the summer f fairy, um, what's it called? I don't know if any of the look at what it's called. Put on the summer fantasy peach backward bonus. I'm just going to call it the summer bonus because that's what I always call it. So we're just going to call it. And put on a very soft pink. I did this one, but at the same time, just in case the arms, arms, and the neck, and the and your legs are really sticking to the bonnet, always put on the woman. Um, body type on so it is good, and then put on the baby doll sleeves and do it the same color. And then I recommend the winter guardian boots and make it all the same color. You can have a bit of it like a different color, I don't mind, I'm just keeping it the same color. And then you need the magical, magical garden of love skirt, and I will make this one a bit different because I don't want that to be too the same. I'm making it a dark pink, but then I will go back to the bonus, and I will make a bit of it the same with the color, the same color, and then I will go to the boots and make them that same too. <laughs> Then I want to go to hairstyles, and then I want to go oh, to um, formal and doing updo too, and go to oh, more hair colors. And if you don't have more hair colors, just do the classical pink. Um, but if you do have more hair colors, there's, then go a bit down to baby unicorn. And then you're done. You don't have to do the same exact face. You can do a different face, but that's how I did it. And I will spin around so you can see, like, the sides and the front. I 
Next color is purple is the next color. So then you just take everything off, including the hair. And then you put on a, uh, what is it called? Uh, I need to find it. I need to find the hair that. Um, so we start with the hair, um, and go to, what, the, um, wavy, 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 let me look in, yeah, wavy, and then, and then go to, um, big boss baby, or Barbie, baby and then the thing behind it make any color I'm doing the dark purple and the same thing if you don't have more hair colors just do the regular purple hair but if you have more hair colors the same thing then we do the more hair colors and I would recommend doing um Moonlight braids. You can do it also lighter or dark. I just recommend darker because if you do it lighter, then it will um <clears throat> then it will just go insane. I will do the same face, just with purple eyes, and I am going to go to torso and eye. I'm going to do the Princess Star Frost bonus, doing it like this and a bit light. Then I'm going to go to arms, and then I am going to go to my my most favorite and first ever sleeves, which is the Winter Guardian. They go like this, like that, like that. And like that. And then I'm going to use the like, Winter Guardian in boots. And doing the same thing, but a bit different. Like that. And if you're wondering, are we doing a skirt this time? Yes, we are. Wait, what is this called? The Cottage Princess. And doing it dark purple, then light purple. If you're wondering if we're adding any accessories, no, we are not. But this is how it looks. Let me show you a turnaround. And, yeah, I really hope this looks really good to you guys. <coughs> <coughs> Please don't mind if I do cough. And then the last color would be blue. Okay. So let's just take everything off once again. And then we're going to use the lovely rose hair and put on the, um, uh, put on the bangs. And then go to Mermaids Are Real. Or does that count? Uh, no. Merm no, wait, that's a different. No. Ma magical mermaid braids. They look very good. We're going to use the same eyes, but just blue. And that is okay. And then we're going to go to torso, like usual. And we are going to use the cherry blossom. Um, um, one, and do one big blue color at first, and then we need to go to this, this, and then we are going to go to the sleeves, using the sleeves, then doing that once more, and then doing the same thing.
And then we got that. Then we put on the cherry blossom shoes, doing the same thing in because we have to have these the same colors. And then we put on the cherry blossom skirt. Make it look as good as we can. Don't mind the pants sinking, the, my pants sinking through it. Don't mind dying. And for this one, we actually are going to have wings, which are the Winter Wings 2020. If you don't have them, that is okay. Um, so this is how it looks on the front. The side, the back the other side, and the front. And now we have to do all that's best and combine these colors together. Not like I'm not going to ask some something or someone like what are these colors combined. No, I'm just going to have these colors like just insanely everywhere. So... I'm going to show you guys how I would do it in yes. I'm going to do it like this to see if it's more challenging. Okay. So well, with the face you can either stay these eyes or do a different eye. I necessarily like the purple eyes. These with the pink eyes. But I'm just gonna have to go for these pink eyes. They're so pretty. And then we are going to the hmm, we are going to go to the one and only um what they're called? It isn't showing what it's called. God um uh oh that wasn't supposed to happen um. Okay, change of plans with the hair. Um, lazy summer waves. Remember to get rid of the bangs. And you can pick. I'm not so. And you can pick um, the hair color if you don't. You can just go to hair colors or other ones. Some more hair colors. There's if you don't have the things. And the purple we are going for is going to be a different purple than last time. Because I'm, well, I'm at least going to find one. If I can't find one, then we're going for the same one. But, ooh, I found one, which is called Unicorns Are Real. It, it, you have to make it brighter. It has like turn like all the colors, including black. But since we don't have black in it, since we have black in it, it's not what we are looking for. So what I would say is dark power because it looks pink. Even though it looks pink, it's fine. I'm gonna make it more colorful because blinding. Um, I'm just trying to make this as blinding as I can. Um. Go for the one and only. Uh, Miss Lady Rose bonus. Then make it this color. Then, uh, this color. This color. And then we go for uh the fluttering butterfly sleeve. I will show you how to get those. Because you can get these for free if you don't already have them. So I will show you that once we are done in making this whole thing. So once you do that, we have these sleeves that are so pretty. Um, you can't really see them. But if you had the magical star sparkles, then I would suggest them and just make them a very dark purple. You can make them whatever purple you want, but I suggest purple because I am doing the purple. Um, and then I'm using a 
snow fluffy that's like something i really love if you don't have it you don't have it it is okay i'm going to use use the deer dolly tea pretty bow and make it the dark purple and this color again that's like our most like the how the outfit is really going to be going and then um what is this called again dragging dragon shrimp rose dress and you do this and you do that then you do that again and then boom you got that um then the cherry blossom shoes because i have no other shoes was besides three shoes and one of them we can't really use for this and I don't feel I have enough money to buy different shoes, but I'm not gonna because I'm saving up my money. And I'm just gonna grab a random outfit, and then boom, outfit is done. And now well, I will show you how to get the fluttering butterfly sleeves it took me a while to actually get these and i don't know how i did get them so if you follow my steps then you are a pro at this game it take it took me a while to actually figure this out myself i had to go to several videos to just find it um so you have to go to diamond beach i think no the beach house I th yeah the beach house Oops, and you have to go into the ocean i will show you by the way i'm just saying steps and you're supposed to go far out into the ocean and if you spot rocks go look behind every single one of them you should see a chest soon and then boom i will show you everything and now i will show you So what you do is you go to the beach house and you walk over around this. You have to go to this side because that's the only way you can really get it. And if you have faster flying, then it's also an easier way to get to it. I don't have faster flying. I mean, on my other account I do, but on this account I don't. And so you're supposed to get to here, and then you go fly out into the ocean, and you'll see rocks. If you don't have faster flying or anything, I just suggest you run. <clears throat> so you're supposed to look at all these rocks and try to find it. I think it's... This rock, yes. But if you open it, you will find the one and only thing. And it will say, inside this chest you find. And then it will show up. And then, boom, you have the flaring butterfly sleeves item. Now let me get out of this position. <coughs> hmm? So now you have the fluttering butterfly sleeves. And then, then you can do the last outfit. So if you already do have the fluttering butterfly sleeves, and then you have a new account and you forgot where it was, then, um, nice. If you're doing outfit challenges with your friend and like it's a one color challenge and you have these colors and then you have to combine the colors and stuff the end then I suggest this if you have the items. <laughs> it's a, I mean the fluttering butterfly sleeves don't fit for a lot of things though. I gotta admit that because the fluttering butterfly sleeves I would say only work for its set but Sometimes people find ways to use it. I haven't, I haven't seen many YouTubers use a fluttering butterfly 
sleeves unless it's off the flooring with my set. So yeah. And I think if you go over here, there may be a chest. Because there was a chest before I'm and stuff. I don't know if it's still here, but it is still here. And it has puppy the darling round time playful puppy ears. I already have those. But now I'm going to make an uh, outfit on this account for Wes. So, what I would use is the mini skirt. And this is only black, I mean white. So, you use that. <coughs> Put it white. And I only have these, so yeah, make these white. <coughs> I'm so sorry, everyone. Then you these. I know these ain't cheap, but I just had to. We just have to, everyone. If you don't have a torso, then please. I am so sorry. And we will have this. And then, last but not least, you can choose everything else, but last but not least, that. And boom. You can make the skirt bigger if you want, but I'm not gonna. And that's all for today, everyone. And have the most wonderful day ever. And if my voice kept changing this video, then please don't mind it. I am sick. I have corona.